Gina Hu. I'm Sherry Yao. Gina, how was your Lantern Festival? You mean Yuan Xiao Jie? Yeah. It was great. I ate a lot of Yuan Xiao, which is Tang Yuan that we have mentioned it in our previous video. Ha, huh, it sounds so interesting. Let us tell you more about Yuan Xiao Jie today. Sounds good. The Lantern Festival, Yuan Xiao Jie, is celebrated on the 15th day of the first month in the lunar calendar usually falling in February or early March on the Gregorian calendar. It also marks the final day of the traditional Chinese New Year. The Lantern Festival may originate as far back as Han Dynasty, when the Buddhist monk would light lantern on the 15th day of lunar year in honor of the Buddha. There are a lot of customs about Yuan Xiao Jie. The most popular one which I did is eating Yuan Xiao or Tang Yuan. Tang Yuan is a glutinous rice ball typically filled with sesame paste, sweeping paste, or peanut butter paste. Yes, and the Chinese people believe that the round shape of the Tang Yuan and the bowl in which they serve symbolize the family togetherness. And it may bring the good luck and happiness to the family in the new year. Lantern playing, Nao Hua Deng, is a typical activity on the Lantern Festival. Yes, we can guess it by the name. Originally, lighting lantern was for honoring the Buddha, but it became a custom through the years. People make different shapes of the lantern, like birds, flowers, and all kinds of animals, then gather together for the festival. Another activity with these lanterns is guessing lantern riddles. Me. People hang up their lantern and write a riddle on it. It makes the other people want to figure out the answer. It became a really popular activity at the Lantern Festival. Most of the riddles are about Chinese character. Let us show you one today. What is one plus one? One plus one. That's Wang. It's a very common last name, which is Wei. I hope you enjoyed our video today. If you want to look for more videos, you can check it online. See you next time. Bye! Bye.